here's a brief video on um, how you can easily type Spanish accents and symbols without a Spanish keyboard using a couple of different online free tools. The first tool I'm going to show you is right here. It's called Spanish.typeit.org. Um, this is a free site and it works very easily. You'll see over here on the left a sample Spanish paragraph. Um, I'm just going to type the first sentence from that to demonstrate. So here I go. And here I am up to my first letter that I do not have on my English keyboard. So it's very simple when I, I just pick the symbol I want, click on it, and it will insert it for me. And again, same thing. Um, once I'm done with my sentence, if I were a student, if I were done with my assignment, um, all you have to do then is just highlight it, copy it, and then you can paste it into whatever um, you prefer. You can do a Word document, and you'll see that all of it transfers over correctly. Um, you can also do Google Drive, your email. You just basically can copy and paste it into whatever apparatus you'll be using. So that is Spanish.typeit.org. Um, the other tool I'm going to show you is a Google-based tool, and this is embedded right into your um, Google Chrome browser, so you're only going to be able to use it with Chrome, and how it will work is, um, well, I should show you it first, it is called Spanish Characters, and it's in your Chrome web store, um, and it is a free one, so once you install it, it will appear up in your Google toolbar, as you see here, Spanish Characters. And to use it, it's really very simple. I just have a fake email pulled up here, um, and I'm going to type the same sentence. And here, again, I have my first need for a special character. So to use this app, I simply right-click after I've installed it, and you'll see Spanish character appears in my right-clicking menu. And then I just say insert lowercase, pick the one I want, and it's automatically inserted. And again, same option. Um, the other way that you can use this app is um, I have had some websites that don't allow that to pop up. So what the other option is, just to click on the installed icon and then copy it, highlight it, copy it from the list, and then just paste it into the body of your work. Again, this is only for use with Google Chrome, um, but it is also another free tool that can make typing Spanish a little bit easier.